Yes. All right. So a month before I was gonna go into that Ironman with Daisy Hayes, I was training for like hours a day. I would train like. I'd get up in the morning first thing, I was going running, I wanted to be able to, I figured if I was able to sprint for an hour, then I'd be able to beat Daisy Hayes' ass for an hour. Um, so I used to do that first thing in the morning, um, I was, and then I'd come back and then I'd train later, I'd do weights, I'd do more cardio. And then it, it got into the this um, routine where everything seemed just just constantly about training and I, I guess I kind of almost lost focus on the fact that I was doing this to beat the bejesus out of Daisy Hayes I mean look at her she's like what 10 pounds maybe 20 at most like I mean I probably didn't need to train that hard um, so then it just all became and I wasn't even because my trainer had left Ireland at that stage I wasn't even training wrestling. I was just working on my endurance and I guess I kind of lost sight of what the goal was. Okay, so I got I was wrestling in Germany and um I was wrestling this I can't remember what her name is, Jesus, she probably only wrestled one match in her life or something. Um and split my eye open or whatever, I finished the match. Um, was taken to the hospital and then um, when I came back and I, 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 I was just like oh I just don't think this is it's, it just wasn't worth it in my head and then I, I, there was repercussions from that injury over there and um, afterwards I, I'd gotten headaches I was, I was dizzy passing in whatever um, and I guess that was what happened yeah I decided that I was going to do a personal training course over in Florida and Orlando in the National Personal Training Institute and the re reason was that was that I'd be able to wrestle more often over here and um, but at that stage I'd gotten injured the doctor says I was, said I wasn't able to wrestle anymore so then I was, was stuck in this um, little uh, apartment in Orlando Florida the place smells like a swamp and um, wasn't able to wrestle and I just did my personal training course and then at that stage I just decided that you know wrestling probably for me wasn't um, wasn't the wasn't the path I wanted to go down continue to go down both physically I didn't feel capable of doing it um, I wasn't strong enough, didn't have enough stamina, wasn't um, wasn't training wrestling wise hard enough and uh, mentally I just I wasn't thinking about wrestling, I just wasn't, I wasn't thinking about going into the ring or I wasn't thinking of anything like that so like I mean performance has always been in my blood like I love performing in front of people but as far as wrestling goes, I just, I just, no, I just lost the enthusiasm for it. Um, well, I'm working as an air hostess, so I'm traveling a lot. Um, over and back to the States, I've been doing a lot of um, drama, doing a lot of other sports, um, like, you know, surfing, snowboarding, that kind of thing. Um, concentrating on that and just, um, Traveling, hanging out with my friends, like I mean, I guess when I was wrestling, I was so, I was so focused on it, and it was just completely, you know, wrestling, 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 like everything that I did, everything that I ate, everything that, uh, like when I went to bed, it was just wrestling was on my mind. My friends were all wrestling, just everything was wrestling, and so now it's just kind of, um, it's just been, you know, cruisy, and I've been working at my job and. Um, traveling and traveling and doing all the things that I wasn't doing when I was wrestling because I couldn't go snowboarding when I was wrestling because in case you broke your leg or something so it's just kind of uh, just enjoying the, all the other things in life
future goals? Um, I want to move to New York. I want to move to New York. I want to do more acting, more drama, because I've just been loving that. Like I've done, I've been doing as many classes as I can in that, and that was what I loved. That was what I loved so much about wrestling. Like I loved getting out and performing in front of the crowd. I loved being a different character, and it's not. It wasn't escaping from yourself. It was kind of enlarging yourself by being another character. You know, it was another aspect of you. Um, and that's what I love about drama. And I, I really want to do as much of that as I can. And like, I mean, I love it over here in, in America. And I love New York. Like, there's just something about that city that's just that's what I, where I want to go. Next month I'm going off traveling to Thailand and Cambodia for a month. So I can't wait to do that. Can't wait to do some cooking and uh, some Mai Thai kickboxing and just everything. Like maybe a bit of volunteering. I just want to travel. I just want to travel the entire world. Well, Shimmer fans, sorry for up and leaving you. Um, other duties called. Um, like I mean, uh, right now I've got all my plans, you know, to go off and 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 do all these other things. But you never know what the future might hold. You never want know when uh, when I'll get the itch again, the urge, if you will, to get back in that ring. But maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Who knows?